So, hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. You're probably thinking, gee, this is really soon for me to do another unboxing and rightfully so, and for it being off-white again. So I just want to be transparent with you. So with my last unboxing, which was a couple of weeks ago, I received these beautiful shoes from Farfetch. I love them. And after closer inspection, after filming that video and after it went live, um, I noticed that there were some imperfections with the shoe itself. So I organized a return, which was the easiest process ever with Farfetch. And um, during that time, I went on to the white, off-white um, website and they were having a flash 15% off sale. There was another pair of shoes that I really liked and it was between the ones that I've got here now and the ones that I had before. So the good thing is I've got to see them. I've got to try, I, I will get to try both of them on. Um, the issue is at the moment during lockdown in Australia or well, in Melbourne, uh, the shops are not open, retail is not open. So therefore I have the ability to order stuff to my house, try it on. And if I don't like it, I can send it back. That's a, that's a beauty of online shopping. I do really, really like retail therapy. Like I said, I wanted to be extremely transparent and the shoes that I have got here are brand new. They are the newest color combination. And so I'm just gonna open it because you're probably thinking, shut up Craig, just open the box. So I cut it open so I didn't have any trouble here. And I'll just take this box out. There's receipts. So the shoes that I returned, they cost me $950, right? plus $10 postage. And when you're spending that type of money, you don't really want any type of imperfection. And they just didn't look like $950 after I got the magnifying glass out. No, like the, the where the combination of the fabrics were joining, it started pulling. And I thought that's just not good enough. So I'm going to give these a go, off-white box. And let's give it a go. Here like this and what do we have in here we have some shoe bags stuck to there now it's quite funny usually on his boxes it says SB which stands for shoe box nice wrapping paper whoa these are really orange so these are called out of office triple zero the previous models had um, a different color away on the sole. The cable tie on the other shoes were made of plastic. The thing that I that appealed to me on this shoe is that it's made of leather. That way it's a li little more supple and that way it doesn't um, catch on things and also it doesn't scratch anything as well. So these are very similar to the Louis Vuitton shoe, which also I really like, but I don't want to spend $1,900 on a pair of sneakers. These actually aren't as bright in person. And I, look, I'm not sure how it translates to you on camera, but they are really cool. I haven't tried them on, obviously, because this is a true unboxing. So let me try them on and I'll get back to you and I'll show you what they look like. So I've got the sneakers on. I've also supporting off-white with my spray hoodie. But are you ready to see the shoes? I love the color pop. Ready, 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 ready. They look a little bit like uh, Jordans, low dunks. And I love, I do love these. The fact that it's a full leather upper with a rubber sole. The, the issue with the other shoe that I had was the combination of fabrics which actually made the shoe, but it actually makes it less appealing for days when it's raining and stuff like that. The fact that it had 
uh, a synthetic fabric and then the, the suede and then the leather. Yeah, it was just too much. This, on the other hand, is a lot more solid. These seem a lot more robust. They're not as heavy as the other shoes. Really strange, those other shoes are really heavy. So I'm really happy with these. The, the detail, the stitching, the, the fact that it says shoelace on the shoelaces again. This color combo is much nicer. They do also do a full orange one with the orange arrow. But these, I love these. These, I'm gonna keep. These ended up costing me 648 delivered. $300 cheaper. So the fact that I'm gonna keep them and the fact that they are $300 cheaper is a bargain. So I hope you like this video. I, I do have an addiction with shoes. I think there's a lot of people that have addictions with shoes. I love sneakers. So I'm really happy, really happy to have these added to my wardrobe and these will definitely say, I cannot wait to rock these. There we go. Thank you. Have a good day. Over and out. Let's keep this video nice and short. And remember to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and also hit the bell notification so you're up to date with any new videos I release. Have a great day and see you soon. Bye.